Hi friends, I'm Laura, this is Baker Drinks. Today I'm trying another cheap bottle of whiskey, seeing if it's good by itself, in a cocktail, and if I recommend it. So today I'm trying for the first time ever, Evan Williams Bottle and Bond. I hear it's great. Uh, a lot of people call it the white label, but uh, I've never had it before. So I'm excited to see if it's worth worth getting. It smells okay. It's uh, sweet, oaky, maybe has a little youth notes to it, uh, a little bit of grain. It smells enjoyable. It smells like an easy sipper. Yeah, it's, um, I wouldn't really expect greatness out of this cheap bottle. It's okay. Um, I know there's a lot of people that like it. I just, I don't know. I don't think I'd be grabbing for it in a neat, but, uh, it's not bad. I wouldn't be disappointed if it was the only thing that was available, but I don't think I'd be out looking for it. There's a lot of grainy notes and um, a little bit of bitterness for me. So uh, just like last time, I'm going to take a cocktail recipe from their website, see if it's better that way, see if I like it that way. Um, so the Evan Williams website has a cocktail that they recommend for this bottle and it's called, it's called the Horse's Neck. This one looks simple enough that I can do it. <laughs> I'm not, uh, I'm not a bartender. I am not very good at making cocktails, but I like to drink them. So let's try. Okay. So this one calls for it just being in a glass filled with ice. I figured I'd take a, a, a fancy, glass, fancier glass, make it look nice. So the recipe is just two ounces of Evan Williams Bottles and Bond. Don't mind me spilling. Like I said, I'm not very good at making cocktails. Oh, a little bit of spill again. That's okay. We'll just add a tiny bit more to make up for what I spilled. And then it just says to, it, has, it says to have the lemon peel in the glass like I already do. And then it says to uh, fill with ginger ale. I'm sure I'll like this one. Before I started drinking whiskey neat, I pretty much loved whiskey and ginger ale, so. Let's try it. I don't think I've ever gone with lemon peel as a garnish in a whiskey ginger. I usually go with some lime, but I do like the extra smell that the lemon peel gives it. Mm, that tastes delicious. So I will probably be continuing to drink these. Uh, cheers, thanks for watching.